something out here. Something only you might understand. Oh my god. Your character is absolutely vital to an Independence Day sequel, but there needs to be a reason to include him. So when you first read the script, what was it that made you think, I could take him to a new level now? That's a good and complicated and, and I think flattering question. Jeez, let me see. Um, well, it's in the script. They, 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 they wrote a wonderful script. Um, uh, and, uh, and I get good things to do. And, uh, and my character has an interesting kind of backstory in these 20 years. You know, I became the director of the Earth Space Defense Program. And, uh, <laughs> and uh, things have happened in my personal life that are interesting. So there were, there were many, you know, uh, they, they wrote it well, I think, so. I was gonna ask what happened to Connie, because she was one of the few cast members from the original film who is not coming back. She's so wonderful. Um, well, they have it in the story. I don't know if I can, I haven't talked okay. to anybody uh, it's on the board of, uh, but uh, I don't know that I can give it away, but she, something happened to her. How about the technology in the film? Because the aliens kind of wiped out the Earth in the 90s. So I imagine nowadays you're working with alien technology, but also not the same technology we have today in re the real world. How'd you know that? That's, that's <laughs> right, that's right. Yeah, as a scientist, uh, I was and our team was able to um, co-opt and appropriate uh, some of their advanced uh, stuff and, uh, and uh, you know, and combine it with our own to make what we think, uh, uh, you know, what are more powerful, what's more powerful weaponry and uh, shielding and, uh, you know, defense stuff and uh, base, uh, you know, strategic base placement and stuff like that. We hope that it's going to be enough to, to uh, if something like that should happen again, but we, we hope. Having made these two movies, can you give any tips for surviving an alien invasion, should it actually happen? Uh, if an alien invasion actually happened, um, first of all, of all the things that people listening may be uh, prone to be frightened of, I don't think I should add this to uh, something they should be frightened of. It's I have no s special knowledge, yay or nay, but, you know, I don't think we need to worry about it. Although Carl Sagan said, people who know science, which I put a lot of stock in, I kind of love it, um, uh, they think that because of the configuration and the size of the universe, there's, there's, it's likely that there's some kind of life out there. But I was thinking about it, I'm no expert, but I was thinking about it today, and if they're smart enough to, we don't have the technology to go very far to visit any life that we know, so if, if they have the technology and they're smart in that way, I can only think that our tendency to fight with each other, which makes us think that they might be fighting, fighting types too, is just our stupidity. The fact that we still tussle with each other is, just seems galactically stupid. So if I had to guess, I don't think we have anything to worry about actually. I think if anybody comes here, you know, we'll hopefully be able to treat them to our most generous hospitality and, uh, and, uh, and, and sense of uh, principles of share, sharing, you know. That was quite the answer. I was anticipating you saying just must go faster. Because that seems uh, to be the answer. <laughs> uh, yeah, you gotta, you gotta run quick. Uh, you know, I, I don't know. Well, I do know. I have some, well, the, the fantasy people who have, who have um, dreamed this one up, this story up, have a whole idea about what you know, what a uh, what fighting species may may uh, may have in store for us, and what we can do, and we come up with some pretty smart answers. I'm kind of a smarty pants myself. My character is, uh, I and I can't tell you what I come up with. So I could tell I could tell you, but I can't tell you. You have to see the movie. Uh. I spent 20 years trying to get us ready for this. We used their technology to strengthen our planet. But it won't be enough. I see them in my dreams. They're coming back.